Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope that 2023 has been fabulous for you so far. Happy New Year. It's the first video of the year. Can you believe it? My goodness. Is it? I'm not sure. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I hope everything is working out for you as planned. This picture is an inspiration for the type of dining table I want. And next to it is a cupboard that goes with the table. So I'm excited to have that done. Uh, for those of you who know, I've had this console made for me. I have two consoles and I'm going to have a third one made for me. Slowly but surely, the place is coming together, but there's still a whole lot to do. It's not easy. It's not, it's not cheap. Um, yes, here's a mirror that I'm having made for me as well. I'm going to have a couple of these made, so I'm looking forward to that as well. It's not easy to set up rooms, I'll tell you what. The next video, I would like to bring to you the cost of setting up each room. An estimation, of course. Uh, depending on the decor that you choose, the prices may vary. So, as you know, my kitchen is not fully done. Yeah, so I'd like to get some work done and put in some flute panels like that uh, for separation. Um, but it needs a full overhaul. I literally just did one side, one wall basically to get us going and we've used it adequately for about a year now. But ultimately, I would like to complete the kitchen um, to make it look something like this. So it will be sort of a continuum. So ultimately, I would like my kitchen to look something like this um, with a few more cabinets and a kitchen island and so on and so forth. Um, I'd like to change the, the stoves and, and things that I brought from the U.S. as well and make it more uh, functional. So in this video, you will see some examples of kitchens that um, Jerry and his team have done for um, some of my friends and stuff and some of his clients. And um, I'm looking at his work um, and I feel like it's pretty neat, you know, and it's definitely something that I would consider. I would like the uh, the range sort of like that, a simpler version versus the bulky um, stove and oven that I brought from the U.S. Um, that actually didn't quite work well because of the current here. Uh, so I ended up buying a regular uh, gas stove um, with the oven, which again, I don't like the look of it. So if I'm doing an overhaul, um, and I'm doing the island and adding more countertops and cabinets. I like to do the, um, the oven and microwave combination and then the cooktop and, and hood combination um, to save some space. So yeah, the fridge will have to be accommodated and uh, wrap around cabinets around it to make everything match. So that's, that's going to be challenging given the type of layout I have. But I'm kind of hopeful that we'll be able to work something out. Um, I'm also asking um, a real estate development company um, to come check it out and see what type of overhaul we could do and potentially reuse some of the materials that are there already for what I have as far as the kitchen. So I'm, I'm sort of looking forward to seeing what options both provides me and uh, decide on which direction to go. These kitchens are really nice. Jerry and his team did really well and I applaud them for it. Um, I think the biggest challenge for my space is the windows. I have windows everywhere, including my kitchen and I barely have enough walls for cabinets. I would like some top cabinets. I would like more storage space. I would like to put in an island. I like to completely redo it. You see how large this window is? I have a total of four of these, which leaves me with barely any space at all for top cabinets. Um, so I'm thinking critically about it. I'm, I'm considering actually closing up one of my windows. I know it's going to be costly. I know it's going to, um, you know, um, 
potentially mess with the integrity of the building if I go that route. If I don't have to, um, it will be amazing. If I can work around the space I have, it will be amazing because I've done way too many corrections and I don't want to destroy the, the integrity of the structure I have. But this, I think, is beautiful. They did a nice job. I like the color combination. It's not too far off from what I have. Um, um, I have white cabinets and darker, I have lighter cabinets and darker countertop. Uh, but this combination of gray and white is not bad. I just wouldn't choose the sink. I, I would do a different sink. I would do a bigger uh, one um, country style sink, like what I have, maybe a bit wider. Um, but yeah, I wouldn't change that, but I would change the, the type of stove and stuff that I have. Um, but I did want to share with you some of the kitchens that Jerry has done and um, what I'm considering to do with my kitchen. Uh, the guest room has been redone. I've, I've, I've shared those videos with you. Uh, it might just be for, I wouldn't probably add audio. It will probably just be a short video showing you what has been done there. It's not completely done. But in the next couple of days, I'm going to set it up for my guest. I have a guest coming. Woohoo! I miss her. She was just here about six months or so ago, and I'm looking forward to having them back. Um, so, yes, I'll get that room ready for them, and I'm looking forward to it. This is nice, guys. Y'all, the color combination is really nice. I like that light and eerie feeling here in the space. And... It looks like a very neat job from the tiles to the cabinets to the countertops it looks nice um, yeah that's one thing I haven't done I haven't done any tiling in the kitchen which I need to do because the food stains on my white paint is just not right and you know I knew that was going to happen and I have the intention to to change that so I'll definitely remedy that um, yeah, but as part of the next videos that I will post, I will be talking about, um, I would answer 10 questions, actually. I'll make it in a question and answer, a Q&A format. I'll answer 10 questions about um, the experience so far, uh, the things that we've had to overcome to get the, to this point, and if we're staying, if we're returning, um, what the prospects are, and... Um, just give you an overall view of the last 15 months. It hasn't been easy, and I'll show that in that video. But the, the purpose of this particular video is to um, give you some insight on what I intend to do with my spaces, with redefining my spaces and making it more cozy and comfy. And the more things that we add, the more it starts feeling cozy. And so, yeah, I'm quite excited enjoy the rest of the video and if you like what you see as far as what jerry has done and you'd like to talk to him about your house and your kitchen um he's quite flexible um those of you who know and those of you who have used him you know he's he's one that takes good direction um so give him your specifications give him uh your your views of what you would like to see in your house and he'll work with you I think these kitchens are 38,000 CDs and up. I think 32,000 or 38,000 CDs and up. Um, but definitely, it, it all depends on your space, uh, the type of materials you want to use and, and how, how much cabinets you want, whether you want an island, uh, whether appliances will be included in a deal or not. I think it would all be dependent on you know your conversation with him. So feel free to give him a call. I'll put his details in the uh, description. Thank you as always. And I hope that this year brings you good fortune. Thank you guys. See you real soon.